members in the team are motivated and empowered to make decisions and are knowledgeable. Moving quickly onto the next slide, successful agile projects typically exhibit some of the following characteristics. So agile methods break projects into small increments with minimal upfront planning. The team composition is cross-functional and self-organizing and a cross-functional team means each iteration involves uh, teams working in all functions starting from planning to requirements and design analysis, design, coding, unit testing, etc. Now agile methods emphasis face-to-face -face communication over written documents. No matter what disciplines are required, each agile team will have a customer representative. Now this, pers this person makes a personal commitment to being available. So this is one of the key uh, elements of Agile which is very fundamental and this is an area where most of the organizations make a misjudgment. So I bring your notice to this once again. So in every situation unless there is a customer representative involved, that's the point where the deviation starts and eventually you slowly but surely move away from being agile, the objective that we started with. Now, most agile implementation use a formal daily face-to-face -face communication. So, face-to-face -face and frequent communication are the two things that have to be read together and these are supposed to be very short to the point meeting and should last not more than 15 minutes. They are typically called stand-up meeting because standing up usually enforces the rule that people do not go on forever, any longer than necessary. Uh, agile development emphasizes working software as the primary measure of progress and over status reports and detailed planning. And last but not the least, the specific tools and techniques such as you know all, all the good things in software development life cycle such as continuous integration, pair programming, test driven development, code free refactoring, design patterns, uh, feature driven development and other techniques they are often used to improve quality and enhance project agility. So there is nothing specific about agile except for the fact that uh, agile is open to all of this. Moving to the next slide. So 